So moving on, uh, posting on Instagram. A lot of people post on Instagram story. They like using GIFs or GIFs. GIFs. Is it is GIFs? I'm calling I'm, them I'm GIFs. GIFs. Yeah, okay. I think it's GIFs. Yeah. <laughs> so basically, um, she just checked Twitter, so it's still on Twitter, but IG took GIFs off. And it was because, and let me show y'all this. Let me show y'all why. It was because of a racist GIF. Oh, a, lot of them are, right. a lot of them are racist. <laughs> and it says, okay, this is the GIF actually right here. It says, nigger crime death counter. And then the caption in it says, or the little box says, keep cranking Bonzo. Uh, the numbers just keep climbing. So it's basically a monkey in the background and a white guy, and I'll put it on the screen, actually, and a white guy is basically saying, keep cranking Bonzo, the numbers just keep climbing. And the caption also says, nigger crime death counter. And that is the gif that someone found, and Instagram removed the feature altogether. A lot of people use them in their Instagram stories or whatever. <laughs> it's a great way to convey yeah. what you're trying to say, but they no, took it off for like that. that. But they're going to sort of <clears throat> they stop. Right? I mean, racist people still post racist it's posts. It's a little bit like, throwing a baby well, out of the bathwater. Like, but a GIF should not. It's like public. Everybody can pick it, and it should not be something that's that offensive and racist. They should have. I agree. They should probably remove that GIF and yeah. just revise all the GIFs that are on there just to make sure that never happens again. Because that's a bad look on your company to pep, to. Allow Allow that on there, but honestly, I it, 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 let me let's go back a little bit. Bonzo, the monkey or whatever that's in the background, he is from a movie in the fifties with Ronald Reagan and another female character, Lady Raising a Chimp. So that's Bonzo, and I'm sure that there's a lot of parallels for like basically them raising a black kid or whatever. So I even though I did not see the movie, by the way. But um, I'm sure they knew something. They knew that that because people that don't slip next to them because I mean slip by them because if there was a gif that says you know whitey genetically declining, they would never like that would never be so on there. I, so am I wrong? Don't people make them and put them? Yeah, well, Instagram I, is responsible because then I'm going to say hello, my loves. Well, what it looks like? <laughs> <laughs> well, what it, what it looks like? It, I mean, it looks like that looks like it's like pre-made. Yeah. Like it looks. It like is it's pre-made. pre-made, and then someone just. Like I could have was probably going through yeah. them. And yes. saw that. Like, whoa, what is this? He said That's he was says, searching. Who's in charge here? <laughs> he said he was searching crime in in the Jeff search yeah. engine or whatever. And wow. yes, so I think that first of all, these people are hired to be on these social medias and to like revise everything, like. 24 7. So I don't think that it was accidental that something like that was yeah, somebody able to let stay that on slip there. through the cracks because I mean, hell, you post something sideways and they're ready to get you up out of here. Your post has got <laughs> deleted. And if it you, says something about Jewish you, people, you suspend it. Or if your cheeks is out too much, next exactly. year somebody don't like it, they report you, yeah, you out of here. They be hating with the cheeks. Let, let women show their bodies off. Like, I think that's sexist. Well, they do that to... No, actually, that's racist, too, because they, they don't let black people do that. They don't let black women do because that. Because white women don't got no cheeks. Yeah. You know why, why would you delete a page of hmm. uh, a four by four? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, so that is that story. A lot of people are mad. I'm one of the people who are mad that it's off, but I, I do understand. That's, a, so. that's somebody. On yeah, I've their, never their seen nothing like that, that on Twitter, though. Like that. Yeah, I've never seen them like that on Twitter. I don't know, I but... I don't even know yet. Yeah, well, I'm they, not that IG savvy anymore. It's too many features. Uh, yeah, they do too much. Like, keep this well, shit simple. Well, but it's they're just trying to, like... IG, they're just trying to, like, consolidate keep all the features into one thing instead of so you don't have to go to Facebook, you don't have to go to Snapchat. Yeah. Everything is in one... You still use Facebook? Yeah. Old people, yes. Where, where baby boomers go to die. He, Social oh. media, like... Wise. That's Facebook, so Facebook is actually used for what it's supposed to be used for. Exactly. That's what, you know, they just really, really communicate with people you exactly. don't see like uh, that. Can, exactly. Nah, Facebook be wild, bro. I be seeing some wild stuff on Facebook. That's where like people go to like real like, like be, Invent. be well, super emotional. Well, well, back I like in the day, it was only still. for college. Remember, you had to have yeah. like a college yeah. domain. Yeah, and then yeah, they yeah. Opened it, like, to high school. Yeah, once they made it gen pop, it just went downhill from there. Yeah, because now I get on there to like let my elderly people in the family know how Riley's doing, you know, yeah, once, stuff like once that. Once Nana start getting on there, it kind of was like, right. yes, and it's not for me. Yeah, but it's good for a certain audience. Like, you have a Twitter personality, an Instagram personality, a Facebook personality, and it's who you're trying to convey those messages That's to. That's definitely <laughs> true. So. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, let me ask y'all this. Is a black man ever innocent, even when they're found innocent? Like, if you look at Kobe Bryant, he gets trashed after winning the Oscar because 
people say that Hollywood is hypocritical by letting him win because it's the Me Too movement and all of that. And when was his uh, case? 2005. 2005. 2005. So... It's like the Nate Parker scenario. Nate right? Parker, O.J. Simpson, even when he there acquitted. Oh, fa- oh, oh, yeah, you get brand- Once you get branded the Candyman, you are the Candyman. Especially that's black it. men. That's, that's it. O.J. Every- Simpson got off, though. I don't think O.J. Hey, Simpson no, did no. it. They say he ain't do it. So he ain't do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got to see that. But, <laughs> honestly, with Kobe... He just needs to stop talking. And people may not agree with me. <laughs> This has come up like, you know, crazy, but like he really like revitalized his career. I thought he was hated like for two years. Yeah. And honestly, I haven't heard the media already bring it up until like now. Oh like, yeah, that's yeah. because they be hating it. They don't care until you until you exactly. do something oh, yeah. monumental yeah. like this. Right. Where it's like, I mean, you getting rings, that's you're supposed to. That's yeah. you're in a competitive sport, but then it's like, okay, mm-hmm. you do something like this. Oh, you mm-hmm. want an Oscar? Then it's like, oh no, nah. but remember that time he had um it's like Chris Brown. But Chris Brown, you hear it every month. Every, yeah, that's like true. every that's time true. he tries to do something like, like what he did with but what he did with Vanessa Carlton on International Women's Day, yeah. he posted her video and just said, "Hey, you're great. I love this song. It's International Women's mm-hmm. Day." And she put up this big post: yeah. "I support survivors, not perpetuate." Bitch, she said, "Just that's some bad shit." That right. was extra. It's like so, she could have ignored that, and kept it moving. They holding grudges against him. Like, sis, did he hit you? Because it chicky hit. Right. Him. Like, yeah. just move on. The only I I can. It's the I'm on Chris Brown side. But I can see we don't know how she's been affected. We got to look at if we're playing Delta. Rihanna, Vanessa Carlton. Vanessa Carlton. That was a lot. She, it was a lot, but who? I mean, you know what I'm saying? Who am I to say that's a lot? It, it, you could have just blocked him so you didn't get tagged yeah. anymore. And kept yeah, him All she he just did, was did a lot. Some praise for your song. But to answer your question, no, we're never innocent. All right, yeah, we're never innocent. No, you're yeah. branded for life. Every time if you Google him. That information will come up. Yep. And so, and it's it's always going to be somebody who tries to bring up your negative aspects mm-hmm. or anything bad that happens to you every time you try to do something great. With black men, that's just what it is. Plenty that's what of, they're going to do. Plenty of white actors have won awards, Academy Awards, yeah, um, SAG Awards, who have committed a lot of heinous domestic shit. Domestic violence, yes. and they don't bring it up. And my thing too is like when a police officers get tried, and we actually see the video, like like of them doing things, you know, unlawful to unarmed black men. They, if they get acquitted, guess what? We got to shut the fuck up. But when we get acquitted, it's like, oh, you're still a rapist, though. Mm-hmm. Like, we think you're still a rapist, though you are. Yes. And they, Even when they kill someone who didn't, you who was unarmed, they're going to go and, and, and put the, the victim on trial for their own murder. They're exactly. going to bring up all your criminal past, mm-hmm. not exactly. the fact that this officer has a history of being ex- extra violent towards blacks, but they're going to look into the victim's yeah. past you, and right. justify it after the fact. You really can never like pay your debt to society because honestly, people think black men can't change. You can yeah. really be a different person that That's you were true. in 2004 and 2017. Oh, yes, no, and really people will still process. use it. It's crazy. Like... You have the ability to change, but I don't have the ability to change. Right. How does that work? Exactly. Um, I, and by the way, I don't think OJ did it. That's just oh. me. Uh, yeah, he definitely did it. I, mean, I don't think so. Say, I think he just needs to stop talking. Uh, yeah, well, because he keeps like problem. putting... Um, he keeps like insinuating that he did it. Like, stop it. Like, he keeps, like, kind of putting it out there. Like, I mean, if I did do it, I did it alone. But you know what I think? I think that because so many people are capitalizing and profiting on the OJ money train, he's like, well, shit, why can't I? You know what I'm saying? Because all these people versus OJ, all of these shows, all of these documentaries come out, the ESPN one. Exactly. That's what I think. Like, shit, everybody else making money off that shit. I just still feel like... He 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 goes a little bit too into the like. I feel I, you. He's flexing off that acquittal, like but double jeopardy. You can't get me, Let, so like, yeah. Like some so you gonna keep bringing it up? I'm gonna pay for it. Yeah. But he paid for it when they got him on that bullshit charge, and he just sat down for nine. That yeah. wasn't that wasn't a crime he was supposed to do a decade for. They said. Oh, yeah. Beat us the first time. Exactly. Oh, yeah, that was, a, that was a time. payback exactly. sentence oh, yeah. right If there, people like, got caught jaywalking, they were like, mandatory maximum three They got years. people watching him now. <laughs> they got people watching him every time he's out and about. Can't people are nothing. watching him. Yeah, oh, yeah. so I say fuck it. I mean, and then plus, people don't talk about Nicole's affiliation with the mob and how she owed people money and how the this mob-affiliated group or whatever executed someone the same way that they did her and the other dude. It's so much evidence. It's like, you only looking at OJ. Okay, he got acquitted. They, did they pursue anybody else? Did they pursue anything else? No, because they feel like he No, got because off. they <laughs> wanted to get him. They That's the like thing. They didn't care about getting her killer. They cared right. about nailing him. Why did he get on the beltway and leave him on? 
I don't. A black man <laughs> and the police. Change. I mean, I'm just saying. You can't get away from them. They're going to find. I know, but I'm just saying that people do a lot of irrational things, you know. But there's a lot of evidence that showed that there could be somebody else. Now, I, do I think he knows something? Sure, but I don't think he actually did it because you would literally have to be a super nigga to not have no bruises, no nothing, no uh, marks on you have and you kill uh, two people. Have you seen his football highlights? He was a super nigga. He was the greatest for the back. I don't think that. Like, I don't think he did it. And to be honest, he don't seem that smart to me. You would have to be a real smart person to not leave off evidence like he did. I mean, like he did it. I feel like it. it was kind of accidental that he didn't yeah. leave it. Like I don't even feel like it was on purpose. Nah, like, that nigga ain't doing it. Like a he, perfect crime. Like he did not do it. So, so somebody affiliated with the mob. You not gonna look into that? No, of course not. It's so a black then, man. if you're not gonna look at gonna other, look at the, the mob run. The well, fans, then if the you're police. not going to look into anything else, then yeah. shut the fuck up. Well, he yeah. got to get acquitted. You're not going to look into anything else. Okay, if he didn't do it, then who did? You're not going to keep looking. So she, that's all I'm saying. Okay. You must acquit. That's, yeah. That's a Shout out to right there. Yeah. 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 It, it surprised him. He was like, oh, this motherfucker don't fit. Because it wasn't mine. <laughs> that motherfucker was out the rain. That's why my like, leather shrunk like shit on that nigga. He was like, man, look, man, this joint all oh, they about to get. <laughs> but then what is his name? Furman, Mark, Mark Furman, Furman or something? He planted evidence and yeah. was in he he played the fifth on planting evidence and he has a history of planting evidence. Yeah. So <laughs> what the fuck? Like it was so much evidence that to say that he didn't do it or somebody else possibly could have done it. So that's why I'm not falling for the shit. They, they, I feel like he shanked that bitch. <laughs> nah, I don't, know. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> it, that show had you thinking otherwise for a minute. That's what it is. It's be- supposed to be a whole bunch of. It's supposed to be a. Yeah. Well, it could have been this. It that's been why that. you learned that. That's, that's why he got acquitted because it was too much doubt. It was you could exactly. not reasonably convict him because it was too much. It was good. Those people versus OJ. Yeah, it was yeah. good. Yeah, no, it was. Yeah. It, really, it really was good. 